what is up guys um so yeah we're gonna react to um cj the champs video called all we Alison the count of black air force now i did miss this i and i did watch a few youtube react to it um well i had to react to this as well because i've i've actually watched the anime way before you uploaded this um it's a good anime it it was all over the place the anime like it's good but they, they get a bit boring they got back to being good it's all over the place then there was a lot of racial stuff it, it, it's, it's a good anime just just watch it it's really good you can watch it on um netflix i think it's on netflix still let's check it out Hopefully. i'm like this right here i likes you he likes you and i won't you. and he won't I don't know if you like it here. I'm hoping my mic is good because I'm using my gaming headset and it's a one-sided one. So hopefully you can hear it good. I mean, I can't hear it that good, but it's cool with me because you know it's a one-sided. But still, it's cool with me. I, as long as it uploads good on YouTube, I'm calm. Now we can do this the easy way or the hard way. One minute. I need my ping. All right, it's on high. The choice is yours. What you want, Luke? What's it gonna be? I, I, I asked you a question, Luke. I can't hear you, Luke. He's my favorite guy. I, I don't want to answer. Luke. I, 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 excuse me, I ain't hear you, Luke. Help me. <laughs> oh, sound like to me, you want it the hard way. <laughs> hey, why you think you're gonna bring your little guy back here? By the way, they are in uh, Britain, in the UK, and in England. Now, you when you watch the anime, you can tell by some of the action. I think the, the these girls are more British than Hi, ladies and gentlemen. It is finally time to return to this big ass, claustrophobic, crowded. Yeah, I need yep. to hold y'all. I think it's finally time to remodel. So, uh, since I guess this is our season finale, why not end off with a bang and cover a founding <laughs> member? Now, I know some of y'all are probably wondering, hey, yo, wait a minute, CJ. Uh, I see the title of the video and a uh, homie's not there. And yeah. you're right. Because it's a retcon. So just go with it. Okay? See, that's why I love y'all, man. <laughs> so, uh, let's just go ahead and get started. So, uh, without further ado, Exhibit A. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, I now present to you Exhibit A, King Vamp. So, we start off with three police officers playing caught zombies against a Catholic priest. And yeah. it's not going so well for them. Two of them already done got fucking, they already need a revive. So, police girl is the last one standing in. It looks like she's not clutch. So, meanwhile, we cut over to Integra. She high as hell smoking. Yo, up. I said this before I watched a YouTube record. This, she looks just like Bella Laika if she was black. You can't lie. <laughs> You gonna lie. Zaza right now, and she like, all right, listen up, cuz. We dealing with vampires and shit. So, uh, y'all is not needed. My asset will take care of this. <laughs> asset? Who the fuck? Yes, my asset. King Vamp, the greatest op to ever walk. live. Alucard. Gang shit. Mm. Oh. Pause. Nights like this make me so hot. A perfect night for a perfect pack. So then later on, we cut back to the vampire that's being an absolute horn dog right now. Bro's like, I Yo, I can't lie though. The police go in this is lang. I'm not gonna lie, man. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> I'm gonna kill you. But first, I'm gonna beat up all them booty cheeks. That's right. Me and the boys are about to get the chugga chugga chug. Okay, first, I'm sorry to pause it right here, but he did actually he did say booty cheeks in the anime, i've watched the anime but he did say he was gonna violate her he did actually say that though in the anime gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. and i'm the caboose <sighs> so you like sloppy seconds huh wait a minute if i'm counting correctly here you got like 20 30 other niggas here and you said that you're the caboose oh my god my nigga you a nasty freaky some bitch aren't you <sighs> fuck you shoot that nigga so all these no. ghouls start shooting this man, and this man is taking no damage at uh, all. Bullet. Bro is eating every single bullet. So then bro starts regenerating. He's like, wow, this new god mode that I just installed is amazing. So bro pulls out the blicky and just starts going crazy. The plan ring around the rosy with god mode on. So the priest is like, oh god, who the fuck are you? My name is King Man Alucard. But some people also like to call me the Crimson Fucker. Shout out Team Four Star. Hey, oh yeah, I watched that. Right, you won't take another step or else I'll beat our cheeks right now. So then this man Alucard asks Saris, yo, police girl, 
Are you a virgin? A, a, a what? Answer, bitch! Have you had your back blown out and all? Uh, no! So he put her in her yitty! Oh. Man, it's gonna come out on him! Nah, bro, this man a different breed. Mind is you, one. this is the first 15 minutes of the first episode. And bro's out here blicking ghouls, zombies, shit, and man. Catholic priests. So while Saris is basically you, you bleeding out right now, Alucard comes up to her and he's like, Hey, police girl, you want to become a vampire? I mean, really, <laughs> you have no choice. I mean, you could either bleed out here and die or become a vampire. And to be honest, you dying would be a waste. <laughs> My God, you are fine. Hey, I will let you arrest me any day, police. Fuck. So, long story short, Saris ends up becoming a vampire. So later on, yeah. they get sent on this mission to hunt down this vampire couple. So this man, Alucard, saw some wall baking the <laughs> door. <laughs> absolutely <laughs> blasting this <laughs> <one> with <laughs> FNJ bullets. Bro, bust down the door like, what's good, Nico? So then do unload the entire clip of a ooze into him. Okay. But you know, obviously, <laughs> that's not gonna work, my boy. So Dude. bro starts walking to him and he's like, hmm, caught you and your girl butt booty naked. That boy and them girl sitting in a tree. P-A-C-K-I-N-G. Patrick! <laughs> he stabs him and plasters oh, him on the I wall. Yo. Yeah. Nah, I, low key, to go bro, out. I ain't gonna hold you, bro. I low-key feel bad for that nigga at that point, bro. Same. Bro basically dumped the entire clip in him. It plastered him on the wall. Yo, that's just brutal. So then he's like, all right, police girl, you're up. But, sir, she's too far away. <laughs> okay, okay, and <laughs> use okay. your eyes, bitch. Come on, now use that aimbot I just gave you. Come on, now toggle that shit. Shoot the bitch, Nadia. <laughs> wow, excellent shot, police girl. My goodness, that aimbot was so well, I have to tell Roberta at the next meeting. So then, it's not. Alright, there was an ad there, don't worry, I'm gonna edit it out. Alucard's out here clearing out this whole building, and he's like, Hey, police girl, Alucard's you need to come savage. on up in here and get some points. You best hurry before the round's over, or else you're not gonna be able to hit the mystery box. So after they finish clearing out the entire place, Saris is like, Yes, my star, we did it. Yes, excellent round, police girl. Now let's go hit the box and. Oh, uh, no. Shit. Amen. Secondly, what was the police girl's actual name? I forgot her name. I always forget her name. It's not just police girl because he, he did actually call it that for a few episodes and then they find out her real name and then they start calling her that. And sometimes police girl was a nickname, but I forgot what her real name was. Shit, I forgot. Something. I, I, I can't remember. Grace, how sweet oh, the sound. Amen. What's good, Nico? Okay. What? One minute. I'm just going to pause a few minutes because I just want to tell you these two backstory as well a bit. Even though he may bring it up a bit. But these are kind of like a... They're like that friend group. Is that that friend you have? You know that friend, like, you're calm with each other, but sometimes you have beef sometimes. Like, you have beef, but you're still calm and you're friends. You hang out. That's them lot. They're like that friend who you have beef with, but you're still friends. That That's... Th th that's them. They they're a weird friend kind of group. It's like it's like a Naruto Sasuke friend group where they're like they're trying to kill each other but just trying to become friends. I, I don't know how to explain it. So hard friends. Yes. How sweet the sound. Amen. What's good, Nico? One name is Father and the Son. And I am here to praise the word of God. Okay. Uh, my stool, my back, my back. <laughs> yeah, that's right. You like that, nigga? I just spread the name of the Lord by blowing out your back. And you next, nigga. So what's good? What's really good? So they start to get to scrapping and Alucard busts Captain Anderson's forehead. But this man gets up and cuts <laughs> off his head. Clean decapitation. And bro's like, yes, that's right. Should have paid your tithes and offerings on Sunday service, nigga. Now, where that little girl go? So, Saris took off where Alucard's head. But dude threw the knife and pinned his head on the wall. And dog starts saying, Look, girl, allow me to start reading you a verse. Now, I made this one up. Anderson 316. Thou shalt art me dragging my balls across your face, nigga. Amen. So they and Tech will pull up off the Zaza and she like, hey, oh, bro, you best that, chill out, um, I'm zooted out my mom, but I still bust. I actually stuttered there. I was about to say Black Annabelle. What? 
I'm in black, better like us. Oh my days. Capping your ass, cuz. Oh, and by the way, homie ain't dead. It ain't gonna be that easy to kill him, dog. So boy. Anderson's like, hmm, looks like I need more preparation and prayer for this one. Don't you worry, though. No, I'll be back. Uh, I'll be back to spread the name of my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Uh. So later on, after they had their fight with Anderson, the Helsing Manor ends up getting invaded by Luke Valentine in this ugly ass nigga from this Texas. This is my favorite episode. I'll be honest with you, though. Nigga sound like he from Louisiana. And he out here doing wood and beat 90s. Nah, fuck that. This nigga from Ohio. So meanwhile, Luke Valentine pulls up on Alucard in his deep, dark, Dungeon, you know what? You know, no, no, no. First of all, you should look at the red flags right here, my boy. Mm -hmm. If you see a nigga sitting in a chair all alone in some big ass dark room and he's looking like he doesn't have a care in the world after you just busted open his mate, if I was with him and he bust through that door and he's just sitting there by himself on that chair, I'll be like, yo. Good luck. I'm leaving. <laughs> I'm going home. <laughs> I'm leaving this whole place, mate. I'm not staying here. You got me fucked up. You think I'm gonna die in here? I wanna live longer. Well, nah, buddy. <laughs> you walked into this one yourself. Bro's like, my name is Luke Valentine. Pleasure to meet you. Oh, oh, don't get it twisted. I know who you are with your little pretty ass Luke Valentine. Now, let's hear a little nigga. Do you know who I am or what I am? <laughs> You're a vamp. Wrong. I'm a warrior. Oh, oh, and it looks like it's my lucky day because your little pretty ass and busted down my door ready to offer up your booty. <laughs> booty? Yes, booty is more important than food. Booty is more important than drinking water. If I see a little pretty motherfucker I like, I tell him like this one right here. I likes you. He likes you. And I want you. And he won't. Now we can do this the easy way or the hard face. way. The choice is yours. What you want, Luke? What's it gonna be? I, I, I asked you a question, Luke. I can't hear you, Luke. Uh, 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 I don't want to answer. I, 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 excuse me, I ain't hear you, Luke. <laughs> oh, sound like to me, you wanted the hard way. <laughs> hey, why you think you're going to bring your little dumb ass back here? <laughs> if I could just make it up the stairs. You're not going to make your thing. <laughs> Let me kill you. Oh, no. Okay. I told you, nigga, you're trying to just chose that eat. At this point, you might as well just let them do whatever he wants to you <laughs> at this point. Hey, wait. Now, come on. Take your pants off. Whip that booty out. Let your lips hang. Come on. Hurry. Hurry. Get freaky with me. <laughs> no. Oh, brother. Now I see what you really are. I thought you had that dog in you like me. But no. No. You're a bitch. <laughs> So yeah, that was Exhibit A, and it's finally time to move on to Exhibit B. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I now present to you Exhibit B, Vamp Anthem. So they end up going to Rio, yeah, and you see, hotel. with this exhibit specifically, we will be focusing on this man's lack of giving a f I mean, this man wanted smoke when he walked in the hotel. Bro at the front desk was like, um, excuse me, sir, but we do not allow big personal items like- Okay, and nigga, the f you can suck my dick all I care. So he starts using Jedi mind tricks on this man. You can suck my dick for 99 cents. <laughs> I can suck your dick for 99 cents. Mm, perfect. Now hurry the f up with my bag. So later on that night, they end up getting raided by a SWAT team because of some random false allegation or something. So they bust in like they playing Siege and just start unloading on homie. But hey, 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 I guess these NPC ass background characters haven't learned yet. So bro got up and just started going crazy. God damn, call an ambulance. I mean, shit, I'm just gonna help the ambulance gonna do that nigga got him in his mouth. <clears throat> Pause. So then the last dude was backed up on the door and he was like, you know what? It was a good life. Bye. Nah, nah, it was crazy, bro. Look at his face. Bro was in disgust. <sighs> Fuck. Push. I was one away from a UAV. So then Holy Sarah comes over and she says, Master, these are really humans. <laughs> okay, and? But, sir. Look, girl, do you think I give a flying f? How would you feel if somebody off themselves before you get your fing UAV? They can lick my. By the way, this girl here, I think around episode two or three, I think, she started having a crush on Helsing. But she never really affected his, her feelings to him, though. No. Because you know she started having feelings for him. Um, it's kind of me. 
Balls from hell all I care. Now get your head in the game. We about to edit this bitch out. Yes, sir. There's another person in this anime you're going to see, but she reminds me of him. You'll see him soon. Hello, master. Permission to go crazy. My ultimate is ready. With one death blossom, I will air this entire bitch out. <laughs> All right, permission granted. Just go ahead, little boy. And oh boy, this man just nonchalantly walks outside. It just starts going crazy. Oh my god! They can use that death blossom. He let it rip. So then they trying to escape, but this man puts a mind trick on this man. He's just and starts making on it. him open and close the door. I throw this crazy ass nigga out. Is I on shoot it? him, What's good, nigga? No. Hey, how y'all doing? Anybody willing to lick a nigga balls for five dollars? Uh, no you takers. You're gonna live the year. Right, your funeral. A few moments later. So then this guy throws the rest of the SWAT team and makes them land on each. In the no. Yo, this is normal. It it did this last time, I think. Just wait, just wait. I don't damage. Bro. Here we go. You see, this is why I really don't get this in anime, bro. Why would you sit around and watch something in the stands like a tournament arc or something? You got all these key blasts and shit getting spammed around like come on let's be real one of those is end up gonna hit the stands and somebody's gonna die this right here is a accurate representation of what would happen if a tournament arc was real so later on they get True. on top of this roof so then alucard is like mm, i guess it's time to release that dog but i must warn you unless they put that like dog a um like a mirror board or something over the people so it's like like a glass and it's unbreakable glass so if someone in the tournament hits the glass it won't go through glass Kind of like bulletproof kind of thing. And then I turn kind into of a warrior, and not just your average warrior, nigga. So then police girls start shooting these big ass cannons. So she ends up making a smoke screen, and oh god. Oh, Tony! No, no, no! Let me make this easy for you. We just no. gonna do it the hard way. I told you, nigga. I'm a warrior. I like you, and that's all I need to say. Oh, now, 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 see, look, if you didn't send that SWAT team up there, we could have did this the easy way, but we had to do it the hard way. So that's what you're going to get. The hard way. <laughs> nah, bro, this man it. is an absolute lunatic. He must be stuck. Red bros, my... All right, we're back. Sorry, we had to add. I didn't figure out that the people that's been behind this the entire time is the literal... <clears throat> can't say that name. And so, uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give you some... Should I just tell you who it is? I'm actually gonna do it. Hopefully, I won't get um, copyrighted or banned. Um, it's um, uh, it's the oh, it's Hitler. Well, Hitler's not in it. It's someone else. But um, oh, what was the flag called? Um, I learned it at school, history and stuff. Oh, I forgot the name of it. Context clues: A World War II party back in the 1940s, led by a guy with a terrible mustache. Like, yeah, come on! Up. I know y'all past history, right? It's like the easiest subject ever. I mean, look, this little furry cat boy yeah, has a message. This, this is what I was talking about. She, he, I don't know why, but he reminds me of the girl you saw earlier. I think when I when, when I first watched this, I actually thought I was a girl. That's crazy as fuck. <laughs> I, oh man. Force. Bruh. <sighs> Oh, yes, perfect. I hope you all are having a wonderful day. My name is Z Major. But oh, for this video, we shall call me Edward Rittoffin. <laughs> Who the fuck is laughing over there? <laughs> I'm so sorry. You sound so pussy through that damn screen. Do you think that anybody wants to sit here and listen to your fat ass talk about war and shit? <laughs> Newsflash, nigga. You lost the war. Because all y'all niggas is pussy. You know what? How you like it if I put this gun in this little <laughs> cat boy mouth? Huh? You like that? Yo, you like boy. that, nigga? <laughs> Yo, when I first saw that, I was like, no way my man did that in the front of everyone. That is wild when I first saw that. 
Boom! He shot that nigga in the mouth. So you know, That's after that happened, and uh, Anderson and Alucard started uh, playing Rock'em Sock'em in the favela. And nah, nah. <laughs> Look at Anderson's face, bro. We're like, ah. I came to spread the name of Christ just for your bitch ass to f up my goddamn glasses. You need some prayer. So later on, this crazy lanky hoe. Oh my goodness, look at that build. Homegirl built like slender. So Millennium and- No, you know who she reminded me of when I, when I saw her? Um, she reminded me as, um, she reminded me of Roberta and kind of, yeah, Slender. It's like Roberta and Slender was mixed. That's who she reminds me of a bit. Ended up taking over this entire ship. So they trying to figure out what to do. And of course, this man comes up and says, I know one way to get on that ship. Meanwhile, oh my. Uh, sir, what is that lanky booty hoe doing? <laughs> I don't know, cup, but she been cranking that shit all night. Oh, oh God, do you hear that? Sir, somebody's pumping the hot shit. <laughs> He just really rammed the jet into the ship. Nigga made himself a cruise missile. And this man just hops out that hole unscathed. Yeah, but look at her face. She she knows she's finished. And look at him. He like, I've come to collect your booty. Can I just pause for a few minutes? Okay, so you know that girl there, right? She was acting so bad, you know? Like, when they got on the ship, they was acting like she was like, um, how can I, how can I put this word? Do you remember the twins? Oh, no, no one watched Black Lagoon. Well, it's like, she, it's like the twins. She was acting all bad and that, killing everyone. Like, she's a, like, he's, like, no one can kill her. Like, she's unkillable and stuff. And then watch when my man comes in, yeah, she's like, oh, oh, no, I'm gonna die. Bruh, she's such a pussy. At the start, she's acting all big, yeah, like, like, no one can mess with her until she meets him. It's crazy. Cheeks <laughs> shall be mine. But then some of the soldiers that survived started shooting. So he transformed and wiped the floor with him. But then Shotty over here sitting in a corner crying and shit. And then there he was, towering over her lanky ass. Oh, Rip Van Winkle. I like ya and I want ya. So let's go ahead and get it over with. Start shaking ass. I will not be taking that easily. Oh, so I guess we're doing this the hard way then. So she starts shooting this man with her aimbot, but dog bites the bullet. Oh, Lord have mercy. Oh, 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 guess what I just called Bobel. <laughs> so the legends are true. He's a warrior. Ah, yeah. The dog picks him up and starts shoving the gun in her. Oh, my Jesus Christ. I can't do this, bro. I can't make this video no more, bro. He already deserves that. Started already. impaling her with her own gun. Oh, I like that. I like that a lot. Born never take milk off. <laughs> Exhibit C. I'm getting ads in the so annoying. Ladies and gentlemen, I now present to you our final exhibit. Whole lot of red. So while Alucard was stuck out at sea for a long time, London has turned into straight hell. You got Millennium, aka the the you know what's out here through. terrorizing everybody. No, no, this anime is so wild. I'm not even joking. Watch when we see Hitler Squad. What's gonna pop up? Guess it. Guess what's gonna pop up. See if you're correct. I wonder who you're gonna think's gonna fight. You're not even gonna think. I bet you said this is wrong. I bet you guess it's all from like the army or some some more vampires. Well, kind of true, but no, no. Just then you watch. got homeboy right here, like. What is that melody? And on the other side, you have the literal. What is it? They got the KKK. Not again. Not again. I thought we buried this after the X arm video. But no. Oh no, they're back. Hailing all the way from Harrison, no. fucking Arkansas. The triple K's, Jesus Christ, help me right now. So Alucard finally pulls up. Yo, when I up first saw them, I was like, no way they put this in this anime. To the no way they did that. After looking like the Flying Dutchman coming the off this thing fucking ass cool ship. Like and this anime. man stands right in the middle of everybody and he's like, oh my, what the hell is going on here? 
on one side we have a bitter party that's still mad because they lost the war and on the other side we have the white hooded crusaders who's mad at every single race because their wives got on black dot com I love your booty. Yo, we got the we got the KKK. They're just jealous that their their wives are sleeping with BBC, sleeping with the black men. You know, will be consumed. So everybody in their mama start jumping this man. Everybody just start shooting. But dear God, it was too late. This man used the level zero release. This, crazy, this nigga man. basically opened the gates of oh, hell no. and released every single dead opposition. Dog is literally flooding the streets with every single soul that he has consumed. They like, oh my god, you monster! How many booties have you consumed? A lot. So it's true! You are him! The vampiric booty warrior! Dracula! But I mean, come on, y'all. I mean, if it ain't obvious, the dude's name is literally just Dracula, spelt backwards. So after he finished impaling and shish kebabbing everybody, Cyrus is like, wow, master, you've become a chad. My goodness, your jawline is. Wait, what was her name? In I keep calling him, please, because I keep forgetting her name. Open the gate. You know what? Of hell. Anime out. It is on Netflix, I think, still. And um, on an anime app. You go anime app and watch it. It's called Helsing. That's what the anime is called. It's called Helsing. And released every single dead up. By the way, it is dubbed and you can watch it subbed. Position. Dog is literally flooding the streets with every single soul that he has consumed. They like, oh my god, you monster! How many booties have you consumed? So it's true. You are him, the vampiric booty warrior, Dracula! But I mean, come on, y'all. I mean, if it ain't obvious, the dude's name is literally just Dracula, spelt backwards. So after he finished impaling and shish kebabbing everybody, Cyrus is like, wow, master, you've become a chad. My goodness, your jawline is crispy. She actually kind of did say about his beard, though. She did say something about his beard. But then this man Anderson come out of nowhere, coming to spread the name of the Lord from the top rope. Ooh la la, Anderson. Do you want that booty taken as well? You can eat my dick, Nico. Get ready for some prayer. So they started scrapping, then Alucard decided to switch back to the dual Glockies. So Brush shoots off like the man's tricep, continues to raise the dead, and beating the brakes off of him. And he's like, come on, Anderson. Try to kill me, nigga. So then Anderson pulls out this nail. And Alucard is like, hey, bro, uh, you sure you want to do that? To spread the name of the Lord? Then it shall be done. So Alucard walks up and licks him in the head. But this man Anderson then turned into like the thorn monster or something. And this man Alucard pissed. He like, God damn it, Anderson. How dare you turn into a monster, you bitch nigga? So then Alucard gets stabbed in the Ooh. head. And then we finally get his backstory. Uh. My man got that Revy backstory. Back in the day, I would used to get me cheeks clapped daily, but I would. The crazy thing is, yeah, the guy who's violating him is a king, right? So couldn't you just get whores? I'm sorry, I'm just saying, like, he's a rich man. He could just call for anything in the world. He's a rich billionaire man. Yeah, that guy who's violating this guy. He's a king. He can get anything in the world. He could go, yeah, say, I want a girl. I want this girl, I want her now. They'll be like, calm, let me get her. Boom, that's all he could do. Why did he have to get a little boy? That's Maybe he's just a nonce. I always I don't to know. God. My real name is Vlad, and I'm from Wallachia. I don't even know if I pronounced that shit correctly. I went to rule it, and I fought everybody. Tatakai. Eren Yeager. Oh, I got off topic. I impelled people. Cause I just felt like it. Nobody could stop me. The Ultimate Empire could lick my balls, but I was caught and executed. I drank the blood and became Dracula. And was that sad? And the sad? Give me your booty, Nico. What if they rip out Anderson's heart and crushes it? Fatality. Well, it was a good night. I got to spread the name of God in the holy word. <laughs> I ain't get to eat your booty, nigga. 
quit crying, harass me, and praise God. Hallelujah. Amen. What? Why is this? Fred? So oh, oh my God, yeah, Walter. We yeah, we find out that Alfred discount. Discount Alfred Walter was the villain the whole time, basically. Way to ruin a moment, buddy. Okay, yeah, so long story short, yo, this man Walter just betrayed everybody. Nigga turned into a secret boss battle and copied Dolph Lamingo's moveset. So Alucard says, Master, please allow me to pack this nigga and take his booty. So before they start scrapping Alucard like, Ooh, Walter, Walter, I've been waiting for this day. You see, Walter, I've been scoping your ass out since 1944. So let's go ahead and get it over with and do it the hard way. So they started fighting, and Walter is actually smacking Alucard around. Like, dog is getting dragged. Bro pulled out the dog, beat up the dog. Then Luke Valentine ends up coming out of the dog. Wait, hold on, pause. So Walter starts using dude as a puppet. So then he blinks homie in the face. But then Walter strings up Alucard and stabs him. But it wasn't him the entire time. Hey, Walter. <laughs> Bitch. Oh, look at you. Your body's wearing down and shit now. And you turn into a child, but it's okay. It's okay, though. Because I did the same thing. That's right. It's a blast from the past. Witness me, little nigga. Lolly card. <laughs> yeah, this man turned himself into an entire little girl. And yeah. if you want to know why, you're going to have to go watch an OVA. Just know homie was rocking this back in the 1940s. So it's like, come on, pussy. Come and fight me. You know you want some of this, right? You down bad EDP, some bitch. So bruh starts making rivers of blood. And he's losing his mind. Look at his zesty ass stance. Come on, Walter. You know you want it. So he grabs him and he's about to kill him. But y'all remember the little cat boy? Yeah. yeah. Uh, he literally offed himself and uh, Alucard absorbed him. And he became a paradoxical cat. So now he's shackled by infinite possibilities. So now he's everywhere and nowhere. And is multiplied by like a million lives that he's consumed. And he can't even recognize himself. Okay, yeah, long story short, they caught our boy slipping. So 30 years passed. And he finally comes back after he was trapped inside of his own self and had to off himself three million four hundred and twenty four thousand eight hundred and sixty seven times. And he's like, oh, just another day at the office. No, can I get a taste? Duh. And with the final founding member taking his seat. The second, second phase, phase of the round, round table, table concludes. If you lot enjoyed, please like you leave a like, show some support, check out um CJ the champ. Um if yeah, make sure you subscribe if you're new. Uh help me reach three million, four no, three hundred, four, four hundred, five hundred subscribers at least. I appreciate it. I'm gonna end the video here. I don't know when this will be uploaded, just be ready. Probably upload it. On the next upload schedule, but yeah, I'll see you next time, guys. Bye bye.